Welcome back to 1969 Teardrop Restoration. Today we're gonna paint the uh, the bottom of, of the camper, okay? It's wood, it's primed, okay? So somebody primed it. And we go in uh, with the uh, with another coat of uh, uh, paint. I'm gonna use the very thick, very thick uh, paint designed for the old wood. Uh, so uh, it's black, so it's gonna look pretty nice. So let's see how it's gonna look after that. So uh, I got already edges and corners done with the brush, okay, and uh, now I'm gonna use uh, the uh, roller, okay. I just want to tell you something a little about, about this paint, okay. It's 100% a, a acrylic and you can see it's very thick. It's like uh, undercoat, it's like a um, kind of uh, roof product, but it's not made from oil so it's smellless it doesn't smell it doesn't give you this asphalty uh, stink in the camper when you're gonna be parking uh, on a, uh, in a hot day or uh, somewhere um, on a huge uh, asphalt parking where the heat coming from the from the bottom so uh, that's what I choose like I said it's a hundred percent Acrylic, uh, it's uh, smellless, doesn't smell at all. Okay, that's what I want. And uh, it's uh, waterproof, it uh, repairs the old wood and all those, uh, everything what I actually needed for this product. Okay, so I'm gonna put the paint to the tray and I'm gonna do all those 
bigger uh, pieces with the roll. Okay. Let's see, it wasn't that long, okay? So let's see how it looks. I don't think I'm gonna go for the second coat. This, this really covers uh, nicely uh, everything. So I'm very pleased with this, uh, with this paint. It's, uh, it's drying pretty quick, okay? And uh, it, like I said, it's waterproof. This is my... Uh, shocks okay you can uh, you can see the bushings are making the noise all this is kind of moving so I will remove the bushings from inside I will order the new ones this is the uh, grease uh, fitting okay I don't want to play with it it's an old one so this will be exchanged all this uh, Shocks, I will uh, brush it, I will clean it, put the uh, grease between so they don't squeak, they don't make any noise. The bearings are actually in very good condition. Uh, they need only a little bit of lubricant, okay? And this all will be scraped. And same thing on this side. This one is not that bad, it's actually doesn't doesn't make the noise, but uh, the other side it's it's kind of uh, I don't like it. Okay, so same thing. It's a grease, and this is my bearing, wheel bearings. Okay, and they quiet and nice. Hi, uh, welcome back. We're gonna change um, the bushings in uh, leaf springs. Okay, uh, I already uh, supported this, uh, so it's not gonna fall down. This this thing is uh, actually uh, moving. So let's see what's gonna happen. Okay, so so we got this we got this uh, uh, bushing. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna check how's the uh, rubber inside, so let's do this. Okay, so this is down, okay? Bunch of washers, okay? Inside of this is the uh, rubbery metal bushing which actually uh, makes this bolt actually be tight 
but we can I can hear it I can feel it it's moving up and down so we're gonna take this bushing out and put the new one so this bolt will be actually nice and tight inside the uh, leaf spring okay and we're gonna do the same thing on the other side This is the bushing, okay, and we can see it's, it's, you know, this bolt is kind of loose in it, so we're gonna go to the local Napa uh, and we're gonna purchase uh, this bushing and uh, this, uh, and this bolt new, okay, and we're gonna place it, you can see there are the extra pieces which are uh, which are which are broken so we're gonna measure this opening and like I said we're gonna go to the local uh, shop and purchase uh, all new bushing and the bolt thank you for joining me today we have uh, bottom of the camper uh, nicely primed and uh, check my next video because we're gonna do fantastic uh, things on this camper. So it's gonna be fun. Take it easy, guys.